like to show you how to do the picture-in-picture -picture effect inside of Ceref Movie Plus X6. I have a video and I have a scan of a Polaroid land camera picture frame that I want to use to place the video inside of the picture frame. On the video track, I have the frame of the Polaroid that is a PNG transparency. And this is a clip of a video that I found on the Internet Archive. What I want to do is to move the video track to the overlay track. When I select it, you can see that I can see the video, but I can't see the Polaroid frame. There's a way to fix that. What I want to do is put the video inside of the frame. So I'm going to move to the Properties tab, select Transform, making sure that I have the video selected, and I do. Now, you have two options in this. You can enter the numerical values to select the position, and the scale, and the rotation, and the center. You could do that. Or you can select the selection points to make your adjustments. Now, one word of caution. The middle selection points will stretch. And as you can see, that might not be something that you want. So I would be very hesitant to use the middle selection points in order to uh, get a video or another picture to fit inside of this frame. I'm going to hit the undo. Went back a little too far, but that's okay. I have the video going to select it. Move it to the overlay track. And now I made sure that I'm on transform. I have the video selected. I now can use the selection points once again to get the video where I want it. And you also have the option of using the left mouse button to click, hold, and then move the video exactly where you want it inside of your frame. And that's it. So whether you like typing numbers or you're a selection point grabbing kind of person, either way, this is a quick demonstration of how to use the picture-in-picture -picture effect using Seref Movie Plus X6. Thanks for watching.